baby, baby clothes, baby onesies, pregnancy, pregnancy test, anything you can do with babies, babies, babies. Abby, stop sending me random pictures of babies, please. <laughs> when are you mm. gonna give me one of those? Yeah. <laughs> when can I get one of those? Tomorrow. <laughs> when will you give me one of those? Never. When are you giving me one of those? Never! <laughs> can we go down the baby aisle? Sure. Oh, really? No. <laughs> Baby Herbert's coming very soon. Oh very God. soon. What's up, Herbert YouTube fam? How's everyone doing out there today? Whoa, you're hyped and piped today. Got the coffee. We, we are, are getting married. No. We are, are buying a house. I wish, but no. We are getting a brand new car. We are starting a wearable goods brand. I'm wearing one here, Relate Co. I'm wearing the Dreamer sweatshirt. You're not wrong there, we did. So shop www.relayco.shop for our new clothing line. But this video is about we are getting a dog. No. Another dog, because we already have one dog. No, come what? on, come on. I don't know what we're getting. Oh. <laughs> Three, two, one. Okay guys, so it is currently September 9th. This was our first month trying to conceive. I just got off birth control. I was diagnosed with PCOS. So I didn't think it would happen, but I've been like obsessing over it. So I've been taking a pregnancy test since Sunday and it all came back like super, 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 super negative. And today I took one, I took two. I don't know if you can see, but there's definitely, there's definitely two lines. tested yesterday and it was like not pregnant negative and then today these strips there's like a very very faint line i don't know what to do i just wanted to document this just in case i am i don't believe that i am i think it might be just be like a false positive test because it's so faint so i think i'm gonna go to target and get like some digital one i'm whispering So my plan, I'm gonna run to Target and pick up some things. I'm gonna get the digital ones and see. I don't know how I'm gonna tell Josh if this is true, but oh my God, this is crazy. Oh, I have no words. Okay, I'm gonna go to Target, bye. Okay, so I just got out of Target. It's currently like four, oh, it's like five. If you just saw the earlier clip, I tested this morning, very, very faint line. So I tested yesterday, a digital and a regular one, and it said negative, not pregnant. I was like, oh, I got a little bummed. I was like, okay, so it's only been one month. It's not happening, that's fine. This morning, I just felt like this weird thing. My period's now two days late. So I was like, let me just test this morning. And it came back that very faint line. And I like freaked out. I didn't even, I didn't even expect it to have a faint line. So I wasn't recording. So I didn't have my like freak out reaction. And then I took another one like an hour later still a faint line i did read reviews on those on amazon and it said it does have false positives so i was like let me run out and get some regular real digital tests i'm trying to stay calm not freak out so i went to the pool i went swimming and just got to target and i picked up a test and if it comes back positive i picked out a little onesie that says dreams do come true and i'm just gonna show josh because i can't keep a secret i can't hold it in can't wait any longer i had this whole idea planned i'd get him crocs that say dad on them and all this stuff i don't know if i can keep a secret so i can't i guess i should not plan this out let's just wait till i get home and test to see if it comes back positive okay so i just got home josh is outside i drove past him so i ran inside took this pregnancy test and it hasn't even been 30 seconds and there's already two lines. I guess we're pregnant. We're right? pregnant. I'm pregnant. We are pregnant. I'm going to be a mama. But I'm so excited it's finally out. I found out I was pregnant 
the earliest you can find out. So we've known yeah. since I was like a Quite week pregnant, now. basically. So we found out we were pregnant September 9th. It's now already the end of October and I cannot believe it's finally here, it's out, we're saying it, we are. Pregnant. pregnant! I know you guys have like been hinting on it on TikTok. I can't keep a secret. It's very hard for me to keep my mouth shut. So I've been like putting little hints out there. So I want to do a whole YouTube video about all the hints to see if you guys caught them. Feature some of your guys' comments, the ones who caught it early. I can't believe it happened this early, this quick. You guys know I got off my birth control in August. My last day on the pill was August 11th. And I found out I was pregnant September 9th. The Herbert gene is really strong. <laughs> Oh my god. I know you guys think that the Mr. Sass King did not want a baby. That was all for fun. It was just a little TikTok joke. You know, Abby, I think one of the best jobs in the world is being a dad, and I can't wait to get hired. Aww. Well, it's gonna happen in like, how many months? Seven months. We are due in May of 2021. May 2021. Um, Hopefully a little better every year. Yeah. Coming in 2021. I think the Herbert baby prosperous. will bring some great energy and positivity. Um, a lot of babies coming in 2021. There it's are. fantastic. I think it's going to be a birth of freshness and well-being, uh, not only for a lot of families, but for the world. I can't believe it happened. I can't believe I'm finally able to say it. It's been so nice. Feels so good. Let's just say it together. What? We are having a... Boy. Josh wants a boy. I don't I, care. He wants a healthy, happy baby. I think we're both leaning girl, so... Girl, boy, whatever. It's gonna um, be great. I said, since I'm a girl, I get to pick the girl's name and Josh gets to pick the boy's name. So that's why we're kind of leaning towards that, just because we want to pick the name. Yeah. Guess what we did today? We went to our first sonogram. So I definitely want to do a YouTube video talking about the first trimester. So I don't want to give too much info in this little video. We had a sonogram at six weeks because there was a little emergency. Today was our first sonogram. No emergency, just to see the little bean. And we got some pictures and videos, so we will put those here now. We are here at my first official ultrasound, besides the scary one a couple weeks ago. How excited are you? Would my Tinder email be different <laughs> than that? What? Oh, okay, I don't know if we'll be able to like snap a picture or we'll get a picture today. We'll see. This is exciting. It's our first real sonogram without um, it being an emergency or scary thing. So what do you think it is? What? The child. Do you think it's a boy or a girl? Um, I mean, we're not finding out today, but just curious what you're feeling this morning. I think it's a boy. I think it's a girl. So that's an arm swinging around? Right that's there. a little arm a little swinging arm around. Nub. There's a little nubbin of a leg there. Oh my gosh. Yeah, so as you can see here, um, looking at the uh, chart. The <laughs> chart? That is our so child. Our child. He's a little... <gasps> Oh, you just said he. I keep saying he. Right. It's oh too early God. to tell. Yeah, it was pretty interesting. Uh, we were able he, to see the- He, she was moving and grooving. The uh, flickering of the heartbeat, and um, it sounded like it was a little rave in there. It was like So we were so excited. It was so cool to see how much it's grown yep. since six weeks, that first ultrasound, which was as so as the size of like a grain of rice. We're gonna share so much on YouTube. This is just a video of us you know, telling you guys you're finally able to say it. We are gonna do everything and anything you guys wanna know about the pregnancy and our journey. So please comment below what you guys wanna see from us yep. on this journey of motherhood, fatherhood, and pregnancy. Also, if I may, any advice uh, yes. from parents out please, there uh, for new parents? Um, we do have a lot of experience. Um, I have a lot of nieces and nephews um, and a lot of cousins. So a lot of experience around, you know, babies and children. And, uh, but for any new parents or any parents parents who have raised their kids all the way through, any advice uh, would be greatly appreciated. Oh, and circling back to the names, yeah, Abby <laughs> said she gets to pick the uh, girl's name and I get to pick the boy's. That name is gonna be wild. Oh my god. Let's just I'm, say that. I'm nervous. Let's just all be team girl. Yeah, that's a good one. We should do that. Are you team boy oh. or team girl in the yeah. comments? Well, um, we did uh, just crush the Twilight series, so it's either team Colin or... Team Bella? No, isn't it? Team Colin or Team, uh, what's the werewolf's name? Jacob? Yeah, Team Edward or Team Jacob, right? I don't know why we're talking about that. Because we're doing Team Girl, Team Boy. We just watched But Twilight. those are two boys. Yeah, I know, but it's like <laughs> the teams, right? No. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> All right, so if you saw the previous video, you would know I found out, I was freaking out, I went to Target, got a digital test, and then I got this cute little baby outfit 
in hopes that it was com gonna come back positive. It says dreams come true, and when it came back positive, I freaked out and immediately, like I said, I can't keep a secret, so I had to tell Josh. So I put it on the bed, and I told Josh to come up because I just wanted him to like come up to our room for, forget what I even said, I just was like, come up here. He definitely reacted in a way uh, that I kind of expected but didn't expect. Let's show that little clip. Oh my God, you're so gross. <sighs> Are you not gonna acknowledge it? Why is it a little boy outfit? That's a unisex outfit. I can't believe I just smelled your pee. So. I did not expect it to happen this quick. All right, so I think that was a reaction that- Well, I thought it was another one of them TikTok videos you do. <laughs> he thought I was pranking him, so he literally smelled it thinking it was just like a fake I thought it was test. just, she just bought a test. Let me tell you, when I got a whiff of that well, pregnancy it's pee, pee. It's pee. It's different though, it's pregnancy pee. It knocked me out. And then I could tell he got super, super like nervous and excited. So I, I decided to stop filming just out of respect for him. Cause I could tell you were like- Respect the king. You're like, the you're king. like cut the cameras. This is this is real, this is happening. Yeah, so. I think too, it's important. Um, you know, we share a lot of our life on here now, but before we started doing TikTok and stuff, you know, besides my music stuff, we're very private. You know, I'm a very private person. So I think in the moment, us experience that together uh, was just important. Yeah, totally. Um, it was it was awesome. That's why I decided to stop Plus, I didn't have my hair done. <laughs> so as soon as it came back positive, I immediately called my mom. So there's no reaction to my mom. I then immediately told Josh's mom the next day. We wanted to keep those special moments. So unfortunately, there will not be reactions of telling our family. Um, we wanted to keep those between us, but they were all, everyone is so excited mm -hmm. and can't believe it. Your mom literally was like, she cursed. My mom doesn't curse. <laughs> that's, a, that's a straight lie. She my mom freaked, does not curse. She freaked out. I should... I'll put the picture of what I put around Nate. So I, I used my cricket and I put a little handkerchief. What's it called? You have a pet cricket? I use my cricket machine. Come on. So I put this bandana on Nate that says, guess what, mom's pregnant. So I put this bandana on Nate and we brought Nate up to his parents' house and we were going to the pool. Your mom like had a pile of towels. She had people coming over. And I was like, look, look at Nate. Look at his cute bandana. And she was like, I'll look well, at it later. Running. He kept running. She's like, I'll look at it later. And I was like, look at the yeah, bandana yeah, like, oh now. Yeah. I was holding it, I was like, just read it, just read it. And then she like screamed, it was so excited. And then we told your dad that same night. We told everyone so quick, cause we, I just couldn't hold it and I was yeah. so excited. So tomorrow is a behind the scenes video of our announcement photos. So you guys are gonna get a sneak peek, maybe see a little bit of our place that we live in, uh, uh, yeah. some cute outfits. I picked everything out, of course, well, You'll find out You'll tomorrow. Find out. You'll find out tomorrow. <laughs> so yeah, we want to thank you guys uh, for following us along this journey. We are here. To, we did it. We did it. You know, the next chapter. Hashtag baby Herbert mm -hmm. is here. Yeah. And if you want to go look at those announcement photos, you can see them now on my Instagram. And I'm sure you are going to post it on your Instagram. At Abby Herbert underscore. At Josh Herbert. That's it. What do you say uh, we got with a little 10 second jingle? Yeah, I don't want this video to end. I've been waiting so long. I'm we so got excited. Plenty more to come. So excited. Make sure you comment below what you guys want to see and any advice you have for us. So let's go out with a song. Oh baby Herbert's on the way. On the way. And it's gonna be a wonderful day. Hashtag Bebe Herbert. Woo! Now I'm hungry. Let's go eat. Okay. <laughs>